hi guys welcome and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to make this simple backless dress you can use about three yards of fabric or more than that depending on how full you want the gathers to be so if that's what you're interested in do well to keep on watching and don't forget to like and subscribe and also turn on the notification bell so that you get notified whenever i post a new video with all that being said, let's get straight into the tutorial. So guys, I've already drafted my patterns. In our last video, I showed you guys how to draft a bustier pattern. If you've not seen the video, then I'm going to leave the link on the description box i've used the pattern to cut out my fabric i cut it in two places one is going to serve as my lining piece i'm using the same fabric as my lining piece as well and i'm just going to open it as you can see it's in two one for the front piece and one for the lining piece i'll just open it up so that you're going to see how it looks like So this is how it looks like. The next thing I'm going to do is to just iron my hair stay on it. I'll be placing the place that has the rough edge of the hair stay. I'll be placing it on the wrong side of the fabric like so. And then I'll just iron it out. So I have ironed it out and this is how it looks like. Please note that the ironing of the hair stay should be done on the wrong side of the fabric and not the right side. So now that I'm done ironing it, I'm going to start my sewing process. But first of all, I'll have to pin down that, that line so that I don't make mistakes while sewing. I'll pin it down to the end. Now that I'm done pinning, this is how it looks like. I'll just run my stitch on it and I'll do the same thing for the other side. So guys, this is how it looks like after I was done stitching it down. I also went ahead to stitch the lining piece and I've also gone ahead to iron my seams open. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to attach my bra cups to it. I wouldn't do that to you, you know. I wanna treat you that way, no. So this was how it looked like after attaching my bra cups to it. I'm sorry I couldn't film how I attached my bra cup, but I promise I'm going to show you guys how to attach a bra cup to a bustier in my subsequent video. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to bring my straps and then I'm just going to pin the strap close to the arm hole area i'm also going to pin the other one just close to the arm hole area and then i'll cover it up with the other fabric i'll cover it up and i'll go ahead and stitch on the neckline on the armhole and on the sides leaving the hemline i'll be turning it out from the hemline so i have stitched the armhole the neckline the sides everything and i like the outcome of everything everything's looking so neat so now i'm going to start working on the skirt part of the dress Now to work on the skirt part of the dress, I'm just going to bring the fabric that I've kept aside for my skirt part of this dress and then I'm going to make my gathers and attach it to the bodies of this dress. I won't be filming the process of making a gathers because I will be sharing with you guys a detailed tutorial on how to make gathers very soon. So I'm just going to gather it and attach it to the bodies of this dress. So 
so i have done the gathers and i've also gone ahead to attach it to the bodies of the dress and this is how it looks like i like the way it came out everything looks on it so the next thing i'm going to do is to work on the back piece of the dress for the back piece of the dress i've already gone ahead to make my gathers as well as attaching my band to it i've also gone ahead to replicate it on the second piece because this is the back i'll be attaching a zipper and it has to be in two pieces now to join it to the front piece all i'm going to do is to get the front piece and i'll place the back piece on it right sides facing each other and then i'll just bring one piece of the back piece and make sure that the seam line aligns with the seam line of the front that's the seam line where i joined the band and the gathers aligns with that of the front piece and then i will just pin it up so that it doesn't move i'll pin it together and i'm going to stitch it down i'll also do the same thing for the other side and when i'm done i'll just attach my zipper to it and everything about the dress is done so this is the outcome of the dress i love everything about it it fits perfectly well i also went ahead to add pockets to it as well as um, a slit this is just a personal decision everything about the video was just the basis on how to go about the making of this dress so everything yeah i like everything and i appreciate you all for watching and i'll see you all in the next video bye